You've seen Wilson Cruz on 13 Reasons Why on Netflix, as well as the latest Star Trek series, Discovery. But what do you know about this handsome gay actor? Follow the yellow brick room. Cruz was born in Brooklyn, New York on December the 27th, 1973, and is of Puerto Rican descent. As a child growing up, he knew he was different, but he didn't know quite why. Not only was he destined to become an actor, but he felt different from other boys his age. At the age of 19, he came out to his parents, first approaching his mother. You had to come to grips with who you are. Your family had to come to grips with that. Mm -hmm. Not an easy thing. No. And, you know, I think that's the story for a lot of people. She was shocked at first, but then she accepted him for living his truth. But things didn't go as well with his father. When he came out to his father, his father basically disowned him and threw him out on the street. Your dad was not okay with it. He was not okay with it. Um, he actually did throw me out of the house at the time. Cruz lived the next couple of months on the streets, turning his car into a home and spending long cold winter nights on a couch of a friend. But if it wasn't for the tragic and yet predictable reaction from his dad, he might not have become an actor. It was while being homeless that he decided to pursue his career in acting. But he decided to do things on his terms. He'd be open about his sexuality from day one. Hollywood is an unforgiving place, but he eventually got his big break by starring as Ricky, the troubled gay teen in the critically acclaimed TV series My So-Called Life. Ricky, I had someone to be with, you know? I know. I can't even imagine it. The show only aired for one season between August 1994 and January 1995. Cruz drew on his own personal experiences of being homeless and being an outcast for portraying Ricky. My So Called Life was produced before the explosion of teen dramas and was one of the very few teen dramas of the 90s. Despite the show receiving critical acclaim, the show's time slot was opposite TV giants Friends and Mad About You, which led to declined viewership and ultimately the cancellation of the show. Then the fan base of the show did something that was never been done in TV history. They started an online petition to revive the show, a first in internet history. When the show ended, Cruz made various guest appearances in shows like Sister Sister, Ally McBeal, ER, The West Wing and Party of Five. But let's face it, being gay in Hollywood has always counted against you when you're trying to be an actor. With a few minor roles in movies and hardly enough time on TV, Cruz made a comeback in 2017's 13 Reasons Why, one of many teen dramas that dominated the streaming services. I told Todd that I would help him with the little problem he's having with his mother. Today, he can be seen as Hugh Colbert on Star Trek Discovery on Paramount+. Plus. Isn't that what you've been trying to teach all of us? Nothing in here is ever truly gone. I believe in you, Paul. Cruz advocates on behalf of LGBTQ youth, especially youth of color, and is actively involved in the gay community and even joined the staff of GLAAD in 2012. Then I mentioned I'm going to do a new video series in 2024 where I'll be reenacting some of the most iconic moments from the 80s. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to click like and subscribe. That way you'll stay up to date as soon as I post a new video. I post new videos every Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. For a similar video to this one that I specifically picked out for you, click on this link or try the YouTube suggestion.